Hello and welcome, this is Carlos Bostre from Corvus Belli. It's, it's freezing now here in Spain, for what is Spain, okay? So, hello and welcome to another studio update. This is January studio update. Let's take a look at 2023. Let's bring some news and previews. Making this video for you behind the camera is Connie, Super Star Wars or Admiral from Other Space. And this is your, your fellow servant, Carlos Bostia from Corvus Belli. Let's begin this video now! Okay, Corvus Belli, here we go. Let's begin with Infinity Tournament System ITS because events are happening and we are right in the middle of something, really. Okay, so we are recording this video right in between two big satellite events for January. Cancun has just happened. Okay, Robert Separ has won with Toha. This is last news. Okay, we're recording this video so, with Toha. My God. Okay, so congratulations and thank you for your support, Australian community. I hope you have a great time at your event, at your satellite event. Okay. Congratulations, uh, special mention to Robert Separ. So, the next big thing is happening in USA, Las Vegas, LVO, which is happening next weekend, is uh, here featuring uh, January 28th to the 30th, so Las Vegas Open in Las Vegas, that wonderful city with beautiful everything. Okay, and next February, we have like three events, okay, two are physical events, which is, are going to be San Alban Satellite in Hertfordshire, uh, which is happening on th uh, February the 18th and Colder and Carbonite in Canada, okay, in Edmonton, in Alberta, uh, February 17th, 18th, the same weekend. So, according to this data, uh, we're going to have a lot of input of data of tournaments on the ITS ranking and it hasn't happened yet. So that's why I'm not coming over again with the ranking of ITS because it's going to suffer a major earthquake and it's going to shatter and we will see after these events who is number one, who remains on top, consistently on top, who is the best player in the world. Four player in the world, the world. The world for infinity, okay. Cannot wait for that to happen, cannot wait for the meta of M4 keep on shaping the community and shaping the events. So congratulations everyone and remember that apart from the physical events we have an online event which is the IGL Infinity Global League on TTS, okay, which is happening this month, okay, January and February 2023. So get your dice, sharpen or your click mouse button, no, we prefer the dice, we prefer the miniatures. Can you have this on digital? Can you have this on digital? Come on. Alex Quintero has made this, okay, and it's beautiful, and, and, and we can yeah, play with it, yeah, Joe's here, yeah, well, uh, super cool. Okay, moving on, let's take a look <laughs> at more stuff. Okay, 2023 news, okay, the next big event for us physically is going there with the stuff is going to be Adepticon. I can show you now one miniature that is going to be at Adepticon before the big back and the big things and the bakuning thing that you know that is going to happen we have a new convention exclusive figure for 2023 remember many problems okay <laughs> remember this character okay well we have a new convention exclusive figure for for this character from nomads for tunguska we have beautiful artwork here for her and we have beautiful 3d renders here for her this is the new many problems okay and we have the painted figure here for you with the hacker hologram and the picture on her hands and uh, which events are going to have this figure okay this miniature is going to be available at adepticon 2023 at chambour illinois okay uh, which is happening on march the 22nd that will be the first public appearance of many problems okay later at august the third okay gencon also usa yes that miniature will be available there physically at the event okay also freak wars spain madrid which is happening in september the 16th yeah there will be copies available for everyone in coming to, to madrid and later Essen Spiel Germany October the 5th okay that will be also a physical event where you can get many problems but Austria I'm not going to USA and go to USA again and then Madrid and going to Essen Spiel I'm not going to any of those events why do you do this to me Corbus Belli don't worry because many problems will be available at the Black Friday and the Corbus Belli Line store later in the year so there will be a chance to get the super exclusive copy of Mary Problems for you, for your normal Tunguska army. So, celebration. Do you like the miniature? Post it in the comments. Okay, back and let's focus 
to Infinity M4 releases. We're recording this video right in January. This means that the January releases probably have arrived at your local gaming store. Let's focus now on the February releases. Okay, you have probably seen them online and they're about to arrive to your store. Those were the Combined Army Hungries, New Hungries, Gakis and Pretas for your Mora Aggression Force, Shakus, Light Armor Unit, the Little Tag for the Hassassin Baram, Agamen on the Traders, New Tag for Aleph, Steel Phalanx, Cosmo Flood Expansion Pack Alpha with Heavy Weaponry for your Cosmo Flood Units, Tomcats, and also the Dark Pansioner Station, both the uh, set and the expansion set. Okay. Also, now, allow me to introduce you to the March releases, which are pretty awesome, by the way. Let's go and check them out. First, Haki Slam Booster Pack Alpha, which is this repack of Haki Slam, Hassassin Rajik with the Spitfire, Hunzakut, always useful Hunzakut, and Hassassin Anjar with Shock Magma Rifle, okay, together in a pack, for you, Haki Slam player. Also, uh, a left booster pack alpha, which is the lovely repack of Naga Hacker, super useful for a left and also for uh, acontecimientos, you know. Also, Garuda attack box with boarding shotgun, plenty of modifiers there to demolish your enemy, and Asura Hacker, a classic model, a super powerful top model on the on, on the on the board. Okay, those are repacks. What else? Uh, U.S. Ariana action pack, the classic action pack from U.S. Ariana. <laughs> some figures are from that. Okay, now every pack is an action pack. And I lost my voice. Corregidor fire team pack beta. What is this? Ah, you will see now. You will see. Give me just a second. Okay, Juan Juan with chain rifle, a new Juan Juan, and robots high well power. We have uh, discussed about this unit before. It's a new unit for Star Armada for 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 O12. So, so we'll take a look at the figures finally. Yeah, let's take a look at them. Now, let's take a look at the new Juan Juan. Okay, it's the classic design for the Juan Juan. You have seen this. You are familiar with this guy. Let's take. Let's say that it's a new take on the Battlefront exclusive version from so long ago, okay, now with the chain rifle, look at that, so dynamic posing, okay, look at those renders. we have the painted figure here, okay, we can take a look also at the robots with the bike and the robot right there, and we have the painted photos here for you, there you go, okay, robots, and now for you nomad players, okay, we have the Diablos of Deep Block concept design here, yes, and we have the Lobos concept design, Maybe this is the first time you see this one, okay? And we have the three renders of the figures right here. These are the Diablos, okay? You can say that they uh, have servo uh, extra muscles and uh, demolishing units. And we have here the Riot counter response on the corridor prison cells of the Lobos right there with the Riot Shield control crowd, okay? Those lovely figures will come together in a pack because you can make the uh, corregidor fire teams with this and also jaguars can make be, be part of those fire teams and these are the march releases there you go thank you so much for the attention this has been carlos bostia stay tuned for more updates and more its shenanigans happening in the ranking in the future go to events participate sharpen your dice have fun thank you so much for your attention bye Shotgun and sniper position makes no sense. Okay.